Basically, with our topic of World Hijab Day, what do you personally think about it? Do you think it's a good way of expressing and explaining the hijab to non-Muslims? I think it's an amazing initiative. I think um, not only the actual day itself, but how it came about, there's a huge lesson to be learned from that. Mm -hmm. I don't know if your viewers know the background, but can I sort of just go into the background a little bit? Of course, bit? yes. Yeah, so there was a, a, a girl called Nazma Khan, I think her name was. She came to this, uh, she came um, to America, to the West, um, at the age of 11, mm -hmm. not knowing very much English, not knowing very much about the Western culture and so forth. Um, and she, she says that she was, she felt very alone um, she was very much picked on. She wore the hijab and you know people didn't understand it. They didn't obviously uh, try to understand it and all her um, schoolmates um, would pick on her, spit on her, abuse her, try to pull off her hijab. Um, and you know she had a lot of negative um, experiences from wearing the hijab. What I think is amazing from it is that nowhere in her story does she talk about taking it off mm -hmm. um, or letting the bullies win. Mm -hmm. um, she goes on to say that uh, when she left school, when, you know, she, she did really well in school and high school and so forth. Um, and she started um, some sort of internet um, forum for hijabis on um, how to wear hijabi clothes, fashionable mm -hmm. hijabi clothes and mm -hmm. so forth. And she got a lot of um, emails talking about other people who had negative um, experiences in wearing hijab um, in different parts of the world, not only in the West, but in different parts of the world. And she thought to herself, there must be something that I can do. And I mm -hmm. think that's amazing, you know, not mm -hmm. to sort of be the victim, but actually sort of stand up and say, there, is, there must be something I can do. Mm -hmm. And she came up with this idea of World Hijab Day, because mm -hmm. her, her thinking was, if people can wear the hijab for one day and just step into my shoes, then one, it'll make them realize what I go through on a daily basis. Mm -hmm. Two, it opens up conversations. Um, a lot of bullying, a lot of intolerance happens because of lack of understanding, mm -hmm. because something is so different to what you know uh, and what you're comfortable with. Mm -hmm. So what she was doing is trying to normalize the hijab. Mm -hmm. And I, th I think it's beautiful. I think there's so many lessons we can learn from, mm -hmm. from the sister in you know, how to sort of stand up for myself, how to not be a victim, how to, you know, do something that will not only help me, but help others who are in the same situation. Mm -hmm. And then obviously the initiative, you know, is amazing because it's getting, you know, Muslims who don't normally wear the hijab to try it for a day, non-Muslims who've never worn the hijab to try it for a day, mm -hmm. um, whether they're Christians, Jews, Hindus, Sikhs, atheists, whatever religion or no religion, it doesn't matter. It's just put it on for a day, and just, you know, live the way I live for a day and, and just experience it and then let's talk.